Hey Yankees fans, it's great to have you here. I have some breaking news for you and I'm bringing it to you firsthand. If you want to stay up to date on everything happening with the Yankees, make sure to subscribe now to stay in the loop. Without further ado, let's get to the news. The New York Yankees have been letting their position battles unfold naturally during spring training, but with the second half upon us and opening day quickly approaching, General Manager Brian Cashman indicated they would take trade opportunities a bit more seriously. Ultimately, the team has a log jam in the infield, meaning they can leverage some of those assets to bolster other spots on the team, notably ones of weakness. Whether it be adding a starting pitcher to help supplement the loss of Frankie Montas and Carlos Rodon or eyeing bullpen support, there's no question they can leverage some of their infielders to their advantage. Cashman indicating that he wouldn't be surprised if teams came knocking on the door is certainly interesting. The most apparent trade candidates are Isaiah Kainer-Falifa and Glaber Torres since the team has DJ Lemieux under contract. They are prepared to elevate Anthony Volpe if he continues his dominance. Are you watching this news and haven't hit the like button yet? Go ahead and click the little thumbs up button so that YouTube will always recommend Yankees news to you. Despite IKF recording two hits and a homer on Friday afternoon, he is still well behind regarding his offensive contributions. Of course, Anthony Volpe is an unproven commodity but has lit up spring training with smooth defensive qualities and efficient offense. The 21-year-old has posted six hits, five runs, and a homer over 20 at-bats, hitting .300 with a .391 OBP. In fact, Yes Network host Michael Kay indicated that Volpe has a real shot at making the opening day roster, but that would indicate Torres is traded, freeing up the second base position for the Yankees' top prospect to assume. Alternatively, IKF is moved, Giancarlo Stanton starts the year playing in the outfield, and Torres serves as the DH. Nonetheless, a few weak spots have become apparent due to injury, so while Cashman stated teams might be looking to inquire, it is entirely possible he's the one scouring the market for opportunities to leverage expendable pieces. Well, Yankees fans, what do you think about this? Did you expect it or not? Leave your opinion in the comments. I would love to know what you think about it. And stay tuned to the channel because I am always posting the latest Yankees news. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out.